Hello, hello, hello. It's Dan from the Fundamentals with another unboxing. This is another unboxing of a USAopoly game. Last video was of Harry Potter Hogwarts Battle. You can see it, the beautiful background. And coming soon is the Astro Trash up there and a couple other sneak peeks around the background there. But that's not the important thing right now. Yippee kayak, other buckets. It's Die Hard, the Nakatomi Heist board game. You know, I was trying to do something special for this. Um, I was gonna do the video barefoot, and then I remembered that that doesn't uh, really translate well when I'm just using my hands. Um, I was also going to do this with the, uh, the table covered in broken glass. Uh, until my editor told me that probably wasn't the best idea. Uh, so, um, Die Hard, the Nakatomi High Sport Game. This is one of the newest releases from The Op. It's one of the big releases they'll have at Gen Con. Soon at Gen Con. And it is a very, very cool big idea um, to adapt Die Hard. It's also using a... Um, it's an original gameplay style. Um, USAopoly uh, is really expanding into, well, the op is really expanding into original board game designs as opposed to um, sort of adapting, like with the Captain Marvel game, um, other board games um, with properties. So, this is Nakatomi High. I love the box for this. It's 15 plus, 2 to 4 people, 60 to 90 minutes. It's a long game. The Nakatomi Heist board game. I'll see all the broken glass. There's a lot of broken glass in this. <sighs> Suspense, excitement, and adventure on every level. Experience the classic action film Die Hard in this one versus many strategy game. Play a John McClane or Hans Gruber's team of thieves and battle your way to the top of Nakatomi Plaza. Yippee ki a motherfuckers. Uh, obviously, I probably don't have the swearing. Um, but as we'll see... You can tell from this there's a lot of cool stuff in it. Um, not to three sad onions, as always. Uh, but yeah, you play as just, you're either Mr. John McClane, you're Bruce Willie, or you're Severus Snape, uh, German Severus Snape, and his uh, assorted German lackeys who are trying to take Nakatomi Heist. Sadly, there's hopefully there'll be an expansion where you play as Carl from uh, Family Matters. Uh, but, here's the book. It is big, and it is th relatively thick for an instruction booklet. Uh, a lot of different stuff you can do. A lot of actions, a lot of um, different ways to play it. Because functionally, you can play it as just a 1v1. You play it as just Bruce Willie versus Severus Snape. And um, otherwise, you, you can add in as his friend. So if you've got a player board here with your different piles... And then the board itself. Now the board is really cool because, I mean, look at the, I love the art. It's very uh, comic booky. Like it looks, is there a Die Hard comic? I don't know if there's a Die Hard comic. But if there is, it probably looks like this. You can see back there, the, the, the different little stations. But each side is, the way the game progresses is through different sides of the board. So, Act 1 is what we saw earlier. That's Act 1, so you play on that board. Act 2 occurs here. You fold it in half, and then you have the board for Act 2. It has McLean's objectives and the objectives of the thieves. And then for Act 3, the final conclusion, when you either win as you either throw... Stever Snape off the top of a building to his death, uh, very brutally and probably as an act of pretty least brutality, or you're able to beat John McClane, the renegade cop who doesn't play by the rules. There's the 30th floor of the Nakatomi Plaza, and Act 3, with the objectives and the thieves' objectives. Uh, so you've kind of got to balance, uh, you've got strategy on both sides, because you're if you're if you're, ha if you're Hans, you're kind of um, trying to lay things out and control the 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 um, 
the, the building, while uh, if you're McLean, you're trying to disarm all the bombs and foil the thieves. So it's a very much kind of uh, battle of wits. Now, the big cool part of this, obviously, other than the board, is the D6, obviously. Oh, nothing fun. Oh, well. No, it is the... Uh, see, it comes in a lovely uh, pre-portioned out little thing here. Uh, no, the, the, the big cool thing that they put a lot of their budget into, and as always, they always put a lot of budget, because USA Alloy is awesome, is... Well, I can't get McLean out. Come on. Oh, God. The miniatures. Which are very high quality. Come on. See, here is Bruce Willie. You can see his gun and his surprisingly thick head of hair. Actually, that's probably for the more comic booky look of Bruce Willie. And then, put him there. And then, Mr. Gruber. You can kind of see his, he's got his walkie talkie talks through and his gun that he threatens you with. And see there. Da -da 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 -da. That's, not, that's not the John Die Hard music, that's the James Bond music. And then you've got these thieves with very bushy hair. Do they all have that fun perm? They do. So you've got the jolly little the the, the green green boys, the gang green gang, who are working for Hans. It's a Powerpuff Girls crossover, clearly. And they all have this wonderful bushy 80s perm mullet and one of those submachine guns with a scope on it because you know you gotta you gotta be able to see uh really far away when you're using a submachine gun and then we have some cardboard cards which is kind of a silly thing when you think about it which are or I believe John McClane. So there's, I think these are these are these are the different objectives that you get. So there's throwing there's throwing him off the building. Happy trails, Hans. The thieves' objective. Ladies and gentlemen, you will be witnesses. Thieves, 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 and then more John McClane. Welcome to the welcome to the party, pal. Get hostages off roof. This whole fucking roof is wired to explode. Find the radio. Hey, Roy, how you feeling? The objective of blow up the elevator shaft. Take this under advisement, jerkweed. Find explosives and detonator. What do you want with the detonators, Hans? Swing on a fire hose. I promise I will never even think about going up in a tall building again. Find shoes that don't fit. And find machine gun. Ho, 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 I have a machine gun. So he does a Christmas movie. All of the internet nerds were right. And then we have the cards. We have, I believe, ah, yes, these are uh, different. They never make these easy to open. Where? really start having scissors for these. Why can't they put on like the special openers? God, it's like they're trying to keep, who are they trying to keep out, huh? Who are they trying to keep out? There we go. These are all the different locks you have to unlock to get through. The CEO workstation. You have to get through to get up to get through as part of the objectives. Um, now come out. To, now this is the 
these are more objectives for McLean. I love the art again. You've got the John McLean with the, with the, like it's just very cool, very stylistic. And then the, the Thebes, you can see there's 80s, 80s bad guy, Hans Gruber. Uh, but, I mean, that's, oh, wait, there's, no, wait, there's more. Ho, 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 I knew there were more pieces. So we've got cubes. Um, if you um, go back and watch uh, some of my other, if you read my review of Thanos Rising, or you've played Thanos Rising, these are very similar to the cubes. They're just plastic little cubes in red and blue um, that represent things. And then we have our markers here. We have our token for Mr. Hans. We have bullets. We have... Um, oh, uh, I guess those, those are probably hostages. Um, some green pizza. More bullets. Um, we have on one side the letter I. On the other side we have a Yas Queen emoji. More green pizza. A lightsaber, candy bar. Um, but you can see even the oh look, there's shoes. Not fun. And yeah, uh, boop boop. We have the police or three letter eyes. That's fun. Um, and then look at the box. You've got the symbol on the side of the that the bad guys use. And you can see if you look real close. I'll show this one again. The I got a gun! You can see they have the, the those cool comic book dots, almost like a Kirby crackle in the background of each one. You can see it's on the, it's on the white one too. It's like a golf ball. But that is Die Hard Nakatomi Heist, the board game. You can currently pick it up at your friendly local game store, um, as well as on their website at USAopoly. I'll have links down below to all the different places you can get it from. Um, and... You can also pick it up at Gen Con, where they're also doing a fun... If you're going to Gen Con, um, they're running a special promotion where you can... Um, you get a code, and you have to try to break into their vault, and in that vault will be a free copy of the Nakatomi Heist board game. So if you're a diehard fan and you're going to Gen Con, definitely go to USAopoly, all right? Uh, tell them Dan sent you. <laughs> um, otherwise... Uh, Happy, uh, well, I'd say Merry Christmas, but it's uh, July. Happy Merry Christmas in July. Always an excuse to watch Die Hard, right? Um, and uh, stay tuned for more as we get ready for Gen Con. But until then, happy gaming. Happy gaming.